What happened in 1990 on flight 5390 with 83 passengers on board? In 1990, flight 5390 took off with 83 passengers on board from an important program, however, as a result of a technical error, the windshield of the plane was shattered, as it was fixed with screws from the outside, not from the inside. Which led to the expulsion of the pilot Tim Lancaster out of the cockpit who was pulled out by the current due to the enormous pressure on the screws and extracted from their place. The flight attendant, Nigel Olden, one of the plane's crew, was able to grab the pilot's foot, making a great effort to prevent him from falling, and it was not intended to save his life, because they thought that he was inevitably dead because of the high speed of the plane and his exposure to suffocation as a result of that speed, but the reason they made them catch him is their fear that if they left him it will enter one of the engines and cause the plane to fall and the death of those in it and this is the text of the plane's crew. Lancaster remained in this position for 20 minutes, until the co-pilot made an emergency landing at Southampton Airport, even though the plane was at an altitude of more than 5,000 meters, and a temperature, minus 17 degrees Celsius, but he survived. Thank you for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe.